We'll call the uh, RIAC uh, Board of Directors meeting for Thursday, March 10th to order. Good morning, everyone. This is John Savage, Chair of the Great Out of Business is open forum. I understand that we have uh, a number of people wishing to be heard uh, today in open forum. So I would ask uh, all the participants to be mindful of the total time allotted uh, for this portion of our board uh, meeting, which is 10 minutes. Um, uh, Donna or Alicia, do we have a, uh, uh, a list and have people uh, ready to go? And who is who is up first? Yes, board chair. This is Donna Malone. Our first speaker is Jennifer Renzi. Ms. Renzi, are you uh, with us? Yes, I am. Good morning, Great. Jim Savage, board Good members, morning. Welcome. President Ahmad. Thank Welcome. you for allowing us the opportunity to speak. My name is Jennifer Renzi. I live in Johnston and I'm a bartender here at the airport. When HMS Host was a food vendor at the airport, none of the food workers got rich, but it was a good job worth sticking around for. I was even able to put my daughter through Sacred Heart University with the money that I've made. I don't know if I'd be able to do that now since Rogue Bay has taken over. Wages have not improved and the medical plan is so bad, no one has even enrolled in it. We have been patient and tried bargaining with Rogue Bay, but it is useless. They don't listen. Time is running out for many of us. We need you to step in. We cannot say the airport is an economic engine for Rhode Island when these are the jobs being offered. Please help us bring good jobs back to TF Green. Thank you. Thank you very much for, for your comments. Ms. Mr. Um, Speaker, our second person is Martin Colel from United Here Local 26. Yes, Mr. Colel. Yes, I'm here. Hello. Hi, good morning, everyone. Thank you for this time and for this opportunity. Thank uh, you for coming. Thank you. Uh, my name is Marin Kalel. I live in Warwick, and I am a food cook here at the airport. Mm -hmm. I have been here for 22 years. Uh, recently, there have been job fairs for the food jobs here at the airport. Many people wondering why no one applied for this job. And I, I can tell you they were not successful because the job the food jobs here are, there, are not good. Many other food and beverage employers offer way better wages and benefits than Go Bay. There's no reason to work here for Go Bay. After I working for three companies, I was expecting things would be better, not worse. When Go Bay came in, I took a five dollar five I mean sorry, five dollar 57 hourly pay cut. I have a wife and a, a new baby, and now with the cost of living go up, I can't afford to live off what they pay. Why, why should the state of Rhode Island taxpayers keep subsidizing the low wages and unaffordable health care that this company provides? Why should service at the airport suffer because of low staffing? We're asking you for help. Tell Go Bay to do the right thing and offer us a fair deal for everyone, especially for those who have been here for many years. Thank you very much. Have a blessed day. Thank, thank you very much, Mr. Seville. Thank you. For